Thank you. We give you praise. We give you praise. We give you praise. We give you praise. Just appreciate him for the day, day two of this program, Real Boat. Mighty God, we thank you. We give you praise. We give you praise. We give you praise. Just give him thanks. Give him thanks. Give him thanks. It's worthy of our praise. Mighty God, it is the glory that is due to you. Mighty God, we thank you. We thank you. We thank you. We thank you. We appreciate you. We appreciate you. We appreciate you. We appreciate you. We give you thanks. We give you thanks. We give you thanks. Give him thanks. Give him thanks. Give him thanks. There is a glory. There's a, a glory that is due to him. Just give him thanks. Give him thanks. Give him thanks. It's worthy of our praise. Mighty God, we thank you. We know how to wear good clothes. We know how to desire good things. We are not mad on the street. We know how to eat good food. We know how to nourish our body. Mighty God, we thank you. The one that died yesterday night, they are not, we are not better than them. Mighty God, we say thank you for the privilege of life. Just give him thanks. Give him thanks. It's worthy. It's worthy. It's worthy of our praise. It's worthy of our praise. Mighty God, we thank you. We thank you. We thank you. We thank you. Just give him thanks. Give him thanks. Give him thanks. Give him thanks. I appreciate him. Tell him you love him. Tell him you love him. He's a loving father. He's a loving father. He lived. That is why we are still living. Father, we say thank you. We bless your holy name. We give you praise. We give you praise. We give you praise. We give you praise. We adore you. You are adorable. Father, we say thank you for the privilege of life, for the intake of the uh, oxygen, mighty God, for the giving out of the carbon dioxide. We thank you. We are not mad on the street. We are not sick in hospital bed. We are not buying oxygen to live. Father, we say thank you, Jesus, for all that you have been doing and our family, you are protecting and guiding them. Mighty God, we thank you. We give you praise. We give you praise. If we say we should count all your goodness and mercies upon our life, night we fall and the day we break again. That means it's not sufficient a day. Even though all our body becomes smart, it's not sufficient. Even as our breath is passing out, oxygen and carbon dioxide, mighty God, is not, it's not quantified enough to be given you glory that is due to you. Father, we say thank you. From our heart, we say thank you for the day one of the program. And here we are in day two now for what you are going to do in our midst this evening. Mighty God, we thank you. We bless your name. We bless your name. We give you thanks. In Jesus' mighty name, we have given thanks. In Jesus' mighty name, we have given thanks. Father, we thank you. Our daddy yesterday, I've talked more about real board, but me, I'm going to be leading us more in prayer, but I will be talking all the same time, teaching and preaching the same time. I pray that God will help us tonight in the name of Jesus. Praise the Lord. Before we go forward, when we talk about Jehovah, Jehovah means the living, the everlasting living God. The everlasting living God which is the one that has been and the one that will always be. Yahweh, the combination of the Greek word and the Hebrew word, that is what they call Jehovah, because they don't know what they will give the name because those people in the time of the, uh, uh, in the old time, they don't call the name anyhow, because if you call the name anyhow, you may fall under the, anger of God, or you will be killed. Praise God. And this name today, because Jesus has died, that we, we have an upper hand and we are liberated, we have access to the holies of holies to call that name. That name Jehovah is only called once in a year. But today we are calling it anyhow, and God is hearing us. I pray the Jehovah everlasting living God will be with you in Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. I pray that Jehovah will be with you in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Before the end of this service today, I pray that you will never be the same. Amen. There is a purpose why a program is being designed. Is designed to meet a particular need, and that need will be met tonight Amen. in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. The name Yahweh, also in the Bible, about 6,800 times was it mentioned in the Bible. That means it's a strong name. I pray Yahweh will always be with you. 
The meaning of Rehobo simply means space, room enough. So Jehovah everlasting God will make room enough for you. He will make a space for you. He will make a, 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 a land that is fertile for you. If you look at the book of Isaiah chapter 60, verse 15, it says, where as thou has been forsaken, hated, and no one to go to thee, I will make out of you an eternal excellency, a joy of many generations. I will make out of you eternal excellency, excellency that does not expire, excellency that have the eternal durability, never expire for one day. Kings and priests reign and and expire in Babylon, but uh, what, what is it called? But um, um, Daniel still remain, Joseph still remain. So nobody was able to vote him out of rulership. I pray in where you domicile in America, you will dominate in Jesus' mighty name because God is going to make make a room for you, not only a room, more than enough room. If you look at the book of Malachi, chapter 3, verse 10, it says, Give your after you give you give your tithe, I will make more room. I'll prove me yet now whether you, you will not see me making more room for you. That means God is a God of sufficiency, our God is a God of surplus, so he's able to make things that is that we need in quantums, in surplusity. I pray the miracle you desire tonight will be surplus in Jesus' mighty name. Will be surplus in Jesus' mighty name. And I know somebody here is going to have the blessing of Luke chapter 5 verse 6, which is the blessing of the miracle breaking net fishes that 5,000 men also in Matthew chapter 5 verse 6, that 5,000 men also, including women, not number, were fair. God Jehovah is more than enough. Is El Shaddai, the breastfed one. I pray we step into your matter today in Jesus' mighty name. Back to Isaiah chapter 60, verse 15. It says, where you have been forsaken, hated. If you have not been forsaken, if you have not been cheated or cheated, if you have not been disappointed, you will not see the true meaning of blessing. Anyone or any individual or any organization that you are working or anywhere you are or anyone that promised you, if they have not failed you, God will not step into the matter. That you were disappointed is a enough reason to show that God is about to appoint you. Because it is your disappointment that will bring about appointment. So that is why he said, where you have been forsaken and hated, I will make room enough for you. That your excellency will continue to reign forever. That we, you will become a center of excellency, a center where people will come to a Acquire knowledge where you become gurus of all gurus. It is not about you become gurara. I pray today, anything that you need will locate you in Jesus' mighty name. Anything that you need will locate you in Jesus' mighty name. He said, where you have been forsaken, he said, I will make room enough for you. Where you have been hated, where you have been rejected, no one to help you out. But I, Jehovah, uh, Rehoboth, will be there to help you to grow. We'll be there to aid you up. I pray anyone that you are watching also under the voice, sound of my voice right now, any area you need that help from, Father, we touch you at that point of need in Jesus' mighty name. I want us to pray as we continue this way. You are going to say, oh Lord, Father, show me mercy and make room enough for me that I may become a, a supplier, that I may become a distributor. Pass through me to bless others. Bless me that I may become a blessing. When God bless you, when you become a blessing, you become a channel. In other words, the tap running water is not actually the maze that is pumping water. The maze is somewhere, but you are linked to that maze. They will always see a, a remnant of water in the pipe. You are going to cry out now. Say, oh Lord, my father, today 
pray, Father, show me mercy. Bless me. Make room enough for me that I may be able to accommodate others. I want to also begin to pray. Father, as we pray, Father, make room enough for us. 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 In the name of Jesus, enough space to accommodate others. Enough space to accommodate others. In the name of Jesus, enough space to accommodate others. In the name of Jesus, as we're praying, I saw a revelation. I saw a, a, a I would say a young lady, I, God is telling me to tell you that is going to make your backbones very strong because it is your spinal cord or your spine you when you lift up a heavy load it is your spine that it affects god is telling me to tell you that your spiritual spine or spinal cord will be so will be so strong enough to carry spiritual load to carry physical load in jesus mighty name to carry physical and spiritual load in Jesus' mighty name. Praise God. And if you look at Genesis, the same place, the Bible passage, the Bible passage of the program is taken from Genesis chapter 26. If you read from verse 1, there was a farmer in the land. Everybody needed food. Everybody needed whatsoever they need for their livelihood. But there came a, a time, and uh, Isaac left the land and went to Gerah. And when he got, got there, he met Abimelech. And Abimelech and the Philistines, they gathered also. Uh, uh, the long story made short, he sold in the land and he reaped hundredfold and he was very great. And the Philistine, they envy him. The, the environmental people, they envy him. In other words, there are people who envy you because of your breakthrough. There are people who envy you because of your lifestyle. There are people who want you dead. They have not known you. They just Talk, talk about you. Somebody just told them maybe fake news about you. They hated you with passion. They have not known you. You are going to pray, Father, anyone that hates me for nothing, anyone that is envying me, Father, my envy will kill them. Begin to pray. My envy will kill them until Isaac became the envy of the Philistine as the Lord blessing. Father, I will become the envy of my generation. I will become the envy of my generation and anyone that envy me that will try to kill me they will die in the quest begin to pray they shall die in the quest 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 in the name of jesus in the name of jesus they shall die in the quest if there is a man to pray availability of God is there to answer you. God is always available to answer you. Pray. Anyone that is envying me in my place of work, in my office, around my environment, Father, and envyness has become to kill me. They will die. Joseph was envied by his brothers until they slowly sold him up to for slavery. Father, anyone that is envying me to destroy, to kill Kill me, shall die in my stead. In the name of Jesus, envious is nothing but jealousy. They so jealous him, loved by his father, free born of the family, hated by his brother, sold out for slavery. Never know that vision gravitated towards the solution. Never knew that vision gravitated towards their solution. As they sold him out, out of out of their home, he landed in Potiphar's house. From Potiphar's house to dungeon, from dungeon to the palace. What a mighty God. Anyone that will stay, you want to stand against the glory of God in your life, they will die in, in the quest.
request. They will die in doing so in the name of Jesus. The one that God has blessed, no one cursed. The one that God has anointed, nobody touched. He said, touch not my anointed people and do my precious daughters and sons no harm. Anyone that touches you today, the Lord shall touch them with the touch of death. The Lord shall correct them with death. In the name of Jesus, if you believe that, say amen where? Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. We are still praying. Something happened where I was living before, the house I was before. There was, when I was there with my wife and other, uh, other tenants, the, the, the room was not that comfortable and uh, God uh, help us. That is where the ministry actually started, and God helped us, and we we got where we are now. Uh, four bedroom flat bungalow. While we were living in just uh, 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 them say uh, uh, just a, a room and a parlor, then say the one bedroom flat. Or what do they call it? Uh, uh, how do they call it? So we were choked up. Uh, actually, we were bigger than that place, but because of the things of the kingdom, we, we, we sold ourselves for the well-being of others. We begin to focus on the things of the kingdom, and God was able to also give us this place. So the long story made sure there was a brother that was disturbing us so much. He will be disturbing in the compound. It will bring a scar. Thank God for God who has not uh, uh, blessed us with the, uh, with the car. He, he is promising, and I know that he has done it already, which we know, but I can't see people in pain without also raising a, a, a hand. So this young man was pouring water and be messing up. My wife would say, keep quiet, my husband, just keep quiet. So one day I prayed, I said, God, let another person take my place. And before I left, something happened, and they disconnected my life, I just with anger. I left. I said, God, I thank you. Long story made short, two, uh, two years later, the person that occupied my room, he went into conflict with that one, that one killed him. A true life story killed him. So I did been, I was the one that fought him that I, I was, I would have been the one that will kill him. May you not, may somebody not pass through your hand and die in Jesus' mighty name. I would have been the person that killed that man. There are people that the devil has caged. There are people that the devil has finished. Please let us advise our sisters, our brothers, not to fight. Leave God to battle the battle or to fight the battle. There are people you are seeing, they are already dead. They have been used for ritual. Because the world we are now is more spiritual, it's more spiritual, more real. The spirituality is more real than the physical you are seeing. If God should open your eye and you see the thousands of hosts of innumerable angels and God around you, you will fear. So live battle for God. On your feet, you can pray anything you want to pray, and it will happen them if you believe. And this young man now today is dead. And the other is in the prison now because he has killed a person. May you not kill a person in Jesus' mighty name, whether by domestic accident, whether by car civil accident, it will not happen in your family in Jesus' mighty name. You are going to pray, Father, let another person take my place in death. Let another person replace my family. Anyone that will stand against my benefit, my blessing as a child of God, in this year, 20, 2022, mighty God, as I step into May 4th, which is tomorrow, that to, as I pray today, anyone that will stand against me and my family, they will take my place in that. Whatever they wish me will be for them. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Because God is making room enough for you. God is making every room for you. Rooms enough. Mighty God, anyone that stand against your daughters and sons, anyone that stand against their way, they they will fall. They will fall. That which they wish them, they shall fall into it. In the name of Jesus. 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 In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Prayer is the master key. 
Without prayer, we are nothing. We can't persevere in, on this, in this earth or this planet earth. Jesus Christ started with prayer and ended up with prayer. He said, in your own law, Father, I commit my spirit. Prayer, 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 prayer. Prayer is nothing but dialoguing with God. It's not in monologuing. It's just to talk to God. Should I pursue? Should I not go? Yes, pursue, capture, destroy the one you have to destroy and take your spoils. Praise God. So prayer, if there's a man to pray, God is available to, to answer. What is prayer? It's a two-way GSM call. Let me put it that way. It's a two-way communication. You speak to God, you wait a minute, God speak back to you. At times, we are too in a hurry not to, not to hear God. God speaks. There is what you call inner intuition. There is a voice inside you that tells you in the book of Romans chapter 8 verse 14. He said those that are led by the spirit of God. They are sons. They are daughter of, of the most high God. So you are led. The spirit, you can't you can do but to resemble your father. You can't do but to resemble like they get like. I am no matter how I am look like dog or dog look like ayana ayana is the ayana ayana can devour 10 dog even 100 dog only one ayana why because they are species a wide animal so no matter how they try to cage you there is god inside you the spirit of god is inside you when he created that man adam the man from the wrestle he breathed into him the life-giving spirit the zoe Way that the life giving spirit, the power of a power along the gutters, the one that resurrected God from the dead, uh, the, the God, the, 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 the son from the dead. I pray among the God, eh, you shall testify that there is ability in God eh, that has destroyed the works of the devil. And my life here yeah, is always, every day is miracle here. Yeah. Every day, I have seen people walk. I have seen dead body, even like this early this morning, dead body raised back to life. I have seen different miracle. Miracle is just like a breath. If you believe, you will see what I'm talking about. Don't, for instance, as I'm praying for you now, you now go back and just go and doubt what you have been told in the light. You will not see result. You will not see result. Always be optimistic. Always ex come expectantly. Always come as better believe that he will, or you will always get that which if you did not get it, that means God does not want you to have it that way. He will always give you the best. And if he rebukes you, because a rebuke is, 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 is a wake up call from a loving father to his children. Sometimes when we rebuke our brothers, when we rebuke our sisters, they pick offense. We don't want them to go that way because we love them. So rebuke, if a father loves you, he will rebuke you. If, if you let this evil, like the, the Bible said, Jesus Christ was saying, he was teaching his disciples, know how to good, good, give good, good gift to his children, to their children, how much more. When you call God, he will not, he will, he will not give you. I pray as you pray with your heart, that which you believe, that burden in your heart, you can't tell anyone. I pray you will see a result tonight, not tomorrow, now as I'm talking to you. Then now as I'm talking to you in Jesus' mighty name. There is so, I saw somebody here now, I saw like mesra pain, monthly mesra pain, and mes, this mesra pain at times, it, it, it is like you wrong, your stomach is hot. Today, that mess drive pain, get out in the name of Jesus. I, I see it go. I see it go. You are free. You are free. You are going to pray, Father, every pain that I can't share with anybody. I can't share with my family. I can't share with my brothers. I can't share with my pastor. Father, Father, take it away now because there is room enough for me. Begin to pray. My inner pain, my inner pain that I can't share with anybody. Father, tonight, take it away. Let them be erased. Let them be erased. Begin to pray. Those inner pains be erased. Be erased. Be erased. Be erased. Be 
be raised, 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 be raised. Makusa katile geke, ebra toko jaka tabaladosa. I will give you peace. I will give them peace. May you receive peace because you have room enough. Madada, ege balako shakara. Mighty God, receive, 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 receive peace. Receive peace that comes with salvation. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. That you pray today does not mean you will not pray tomorrow. Salvation is an handbag, just like a woman or women handbag. You know, thank God for women and uh, also thank God for the men. Our women, they have handbag inside. You will see makeup, you can see airbrush, you can see other things like that. When you became born again, it's a package to you from God. Sometimes you will see remnant of corn that, it's, that is in the bag. So whatever you see in the bag is what you make do of. Salvation is like a female amber handed over to you by God. There is persecution. Remember Matthew chapter 5, verse 9 and 10, 10 and 11. The, the people that came before you, they were persecuted. Also, you will you be persecuted because this world is not yours. You are just in this world to doing business in this world to take account because you are a diplomat here. So it's an handbag. Whatever you see that you pray today does not mean you will not pray tomorrow. Pray until your joy is full. And your joy will continue to be full when you pray the more. I pray that God tonight will make you a prayer machine. When you become a prayer machine, look at what I call a prayer machine. Even when you are sleeping, your spirit is praying. You don't understand. I pray tonight. Somebody watching me now. As you are sleeping, your spirit is praying in the name of Jesus. I am blessing you with my heart as what I am experiencing. You will also experience as you are sleeping, your spirit will stand up and be praying. There is a level in God you get to. If they shoot bullet, there is a way bullet will, will, will go off. It will not touch you because your spirit has been developed to shield you. I pray your spirit will be shielding you in Jesus' mighty name. I pray your spirit will be shielding you in Jesus' mighty name. Now, when you are Born again, you are what we call positional sanctification. Positional sanctification is called instant sanctification. That means you are you you are saved from the power of death. Death cannot kill you. You are not permitted to die prematurely because God has already made a room for you. He has already given you a landmark that is so wide, so voluminous that we accommodate many on earth. Praise God. Now, if when you are born again, you have this positional sanctification, the second one is what we call experiential sanctification or constant sanctification or continuous sanctification. That means you keep on reading the Bible and reading the Bible. In the Bible, you will see yourself there. Thou shall not kill. That is not our apostle Victor. Thou shall not kill. You should not kill. It is not in Gozi or Chim. I'm seeing that I'm seeing myself. It's a mirror. God's word is like a mirror. You used to mirror and check yourself whether you are fit for the race or not. Then there is what we call ultimate sanctification. The first one is uh, well, positional same from the power of death. The other second one is continuous sanctification, same from the power of sin. Sin, sin have no dominion over you. Actually, we walk, we trade, we do everything by grace. We can't fail at death, but sin abiding in life, grace will not abound. Then the third one is ultimate sanctification, safe from the presence of sin and death. I pray these three stages we will conquer all in Jesus' mighty name. And if you want to look at it this way, now when we say positional sanctification, you were say you are you have been saved, you are saved, you shall be saved. 
what was what is being said your spirit was saved what is what is saved now your soul what shall be saved your body your whole body shall be saved i pray you will experience it in jesus mighty name back to greatness back to greatness abraham isaac followed the stead of his father abraham was wealthy and was blessed he succeeded through reign of cattle Isaac, his son, came into the scene. He succeeded through, through farming. And also, what is it called? Jacob came into the scene. He succeeded through crossbreeding animal. He will bring, he will bring goat and crossbreed it with sheep. And they will give back to another species. That is what, what made him wealthy. There are particular things we do. We know how to do it better than others. So put more effort in that. That is a, a point that the problem you are created to solve in the world. Now, Isaac, Isaac came in the state of his father. He was very great and very strong. There is nothing that comes from God that will not have room enough. There is nothing that comes from God that will not be great. Whatever that is limiting you is this celestial beings, evil, wicked forces, because he said in the book of in the book of Ephesians chapter 6, verse 12, we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against power, against rulers of darkness, against spiritual wickedness in high places. In high places. So we need extra celestial power as you develop your celestial, uh, the terrestrial being. Because the celestial, the spirit needs the body to function. It can, the spirit cannot just go. Air cannot just start until he enter a body. It can enter an animal to operate. I pray today as you open your heart and your system for God to envelop you also to use you, correct usage, I pray you will be seeing the manifestation of God's glory in Jesus' mighty name. You will be seeing the manifestation of God's glory in Jesus' mighty name. What am I trying to say? I want you to pray right now as we also continue that God, Father, build yourself in me, walk in me. God in you is sanctification. You in God is salvation. Christ in you sanctifies you. You in Christ is salvation. Father, enter me. I be in you. I abide in you. I am saved. Abide in me. Clean me up. Father, help me today to abide in you. Abide in me, Lord. Begin to pray. When God abides in you, your life becomes prayer. Anywhere you go, you mutter word in the spirit. You may not be talking, you may not be shouting, but your spirit is praying. Father, help me. Sanctify me that my spirit will be praying today. Begin to pray. Mighty God, equip their spirit man, equip their soul, equip their body, make them the for the usefulness and the usage of the master. Mighty God, a vessel unto honor make them in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus a vessel unto honor begin to pray make me a vessel sanctify me ventilate me send the Holy Ghost to ventilate me mighty God open me up fire me up fire up my mental faculty help me Lord help me Lord help me Lord Fire of the Holy Ghost, mighty God, Magado Kosatelera, Egadalagadaba, Shente Balosha. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. As I was praying, I saw like a man, a bit elderly, uh, and I saw a white ball as 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 if the man was teaching. I saw crowd was teaching on a black ball, both. We're on a white board. This is a foreign board. And, and this, there are white people there. There are white men. There, there are white women. There are blacks there. And God says, I should tell you that he's taking you from where you are now to a place of prominence in the name of Jesus. 
God has made room for you. Receive in Jesus' name. Receive in Jesus' name. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name. In the school of power, like I always say, there are no graduates. There are no graduates. When Jesus Christ left, he left only one blank check. In my name. In my name. In my name. Remember John chapter... Chapter 14, verse 2 and 3. It says, in my father's kingdom, there are many mansions. I go to prepare a place where I will be. I also will you be. I'm coming to take you home. Now, he now send the Holy Ghost to take care of that for us. So he said, he said, if you don't go, the Holy Ghost will not come. Before you can have massive, excessive over, overflowing, overblowing miracles, room and all, you have to partner with the Holy Ghost. You have to partner with the Holy Ghost, which is the spirit of Jesus Christ. The spirit of Jesus Christ. Holy Ghost is the spirit of Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ also is God. When we get to heaven, we will not see Jesus. We only see Christ. The body he used, he used was Jesus. But the Christ is the anointed one. I pray today your body will become a vessel unto honor in Jesus' mighty name. Now, there are forces that in that prayer. There are forces that in that prayer. There are forces Second Corinthians chapter 10, verse 3 to 5. Though we walk in the flesh, but we are not warring after the flesh, but our weapon of warfare are not cannon, but mighty unto the pulling down of strongholds. There are some things our Father have done or we have mistakenly, or we mistakenly did in the time past. It has become a foothold. It has become a little grip. Very soon, it will become a, 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 a hole, a full hole. But today, God said, I should tell you that every spiritual embargo from our fathers, your forefathers, your great grandfather, what they're watching today, because he has given you the privilege of room and all, has been destroyed in Jesus' mighty name. There are demons that control the airway. Remember Ephesians chapter 6, verse 12. We wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principality, against power, against rule, uh, rulers of darkness, against spiritual wickedness. Actually, Paul turned it upside down. He used the, the smallest to talk about the greatest. So if you want to count the spiritual wickedness, rulers of darkness, power, and principality, principalities are the least. It is principality, the queen of Pasha, the king, uh, the, 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 the prince of Pasha with El Danas prayer for 21 days. Sometimes you are brave, you will not see results. There are hindrances on the airway. I pray today. As you join me and pray, say, oh, Lord, my father, whatever power that with all prayer in the airway, on the airway, father, today, let them clear by fire. Let them clear whatever with all prayer that makes my prayer not to go further. Your prayer cannot reach into the heavenly. There are Abaddon's, there are Lavianta, there are Shimodi, there are Mamuti, there are Ashtaro, there are, there, there are queen of heaven that hold your prayer. There are Magog, there are Ba, there are, there are Mamuti. There are, there, 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 there are Ashibal. There are different kind of evil spirit that hold your prayer. If you can call them by name, you can conquer them also. Bebzebub are the one that control the air. That hijack play. That is, is involved in accident. It need blood. Is the errand boy to Lucifer? Mighty God, to the out these forces shall be counteracted and be destroyed. Abaddon and uh, 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 Ashtaroth, they are in Icara, they are the free matcher. There are four of them, the queen of heaven. You see it in the Bible, but the name is Ashtaroth, the queen of heaven. You will see sometimes, you will see when, when the moon is about to come out, you will see like a lady carrying baby in a, a form of baby in the moon. That is Ashtaroth. I don't want to go more deeper. 
it, it is the mother of fertility of Olympian God. Is the is 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 the, is the worship the worship that 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 that, that evil uh, evil demon of fertility. They worship it. It's New Year festival in the village that is after they are worshiping. I don't want to go too deep so that it will not be, though we, we teach that in Bible school. Uh, though I pray today, all these forces will not have any, any impact in your life. If you can know their name, if you can address them, they will remove, they will go off. You are going to pray. Every forces of darkness in the airway, in dream my prayer, not to have room enough. Anywhere I go, that is making my prayer not to work. I will pray as if my prayer went, came back to me. Father, Every spirit on the airway returning my prayer, hijacking the blessing. He said, The Prince of Pasha, with, with Daniel's prayer for 21 days. Thank God for Michael, who came, the minister of war. He was designed for war. Jordan Gabriel was the messenger. Why Lucifer? Songs. I pray today, Michael will work for you. Begin to pray. Every power, principality, powers, rulers of darkness, spiritual wicked. In the heaven, I clear them by the force of the Holy Ghost. Breathe fire upon them. Let them be consumed. 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 In the name of God, fall fire upon them and your villages. Makatolege, madadaga, esoke pratoko jagada, ende keto baraba. Let them be consumed by fire. Let them be consumed by fire in the name of Jesus. Be consumed by fire. Be consumed by fire. Every form of Ashtarot, Ashimodi, Mamuti, Magog, Abaddon, Mighty God, Lavianta, we conquer them. Bar, we conquer them. Maka, Toloba, every blood sucking demon on the airways. Father, we conquer them in the name of Jesus. Mazote, Dede, Ekabalago, Senke, Brodoka, Eza, Dadadada, Ekoko, in Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Praise God. At times, if God we pray and God did not answer, at times he said, Wait. Secondly, first one, he may answer very fast. If he wants you to mature and see things like he sees, want to mature you, he will make you wait. All miracles are not miracles. If God truly wants to bless you, even the poor and the rich will beckon on you to do something that to, to call on that thing you have. A mechanic who knows his work on perfectly until it touches you will his phone number will be given to many until that man touches your car, you are not well pleased. When God want, deliberately wants to bless you, as he's blessing you now, as you are going to be seeing results, old, young, adolescent, elders, poor, rich, they will call you. There is a particular thing in your life that you have not amassed. There's a particular gift inside you you have not seen. I pray whatever that is covering them, be open in Jesus' mighty name. You are going to call God. Father, the Jehovah Rumenov, the eternal living God, Father, I am that I am. Lord Jesus, Father, fire me up, O Lord. Make me, O Lord, a man and a woman that will continue to seek your face, that will continue to do your things, that will continue to do that which you love, begin to pray, 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 begin to pray. I hear him say where you are now is not where you're supposed to be. Begin to move forward, 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 move forward. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. If someone is under a curse, number one, you know, number one, how you know a man that is under a curse or a woman? He or she will bite the finger that fed him. It's a spiritual manipulation. 
And when you bite the finger that fed you, you are already in direct conflict with God. And you know what that means. Always remember there was somebody or some people that held the ladder of greatness for you. Someday you will be coming down, you will need them. That's why I'll always tell all our people here, be careful how you treat people. People are door, open and enter gently. The person, what you thought you are today, somebody that you thought that is poor, may know somebody that knows somebody that knows somebody that is higher, greater, and bigger in authority than you. So human being at all, respect, love, kind, humbleness, humility, that is the nature of Christ. I always say, if you are not humble, you may tumble. And anger, number two, you see the people, they are very furious. They are very furious. Every spirit of anger, every spirit of near syndrome, like I want to break through. You, you can't finish what you started. You end halfway. As if you finish it, you can't finish it. Today, let that altar be broken, be destroyed by fire. Some of us have our roots in Nigeria. Some of us have our roots in some African country. Remember, there is a lineage we are connected to. Our lineage is not always good. Our lineage is, 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 is commensurated or, or knitted with shrines. So we continue to feast and fast and break that yoke. Devil never give us easily. Some are, the third one is that when you see your epa, you begin to run away from your epa. You want to come closer to your epa, but something will be drawing you back. No, no. You know that when you go to that place, you will see a breakthrough. But something will say postponement, postponement, dilly dally, dilly dally is another nail you used to nail down your destiny. You used to nail, there are some things we do early. Somebody celebrating buying car at the 90 years old. That is a spirit, a big spirit of delay. Because some people say delay is not denial. But in this case, delay is denial. You are going to shout out every spirit of delay, every spirit of disappointment. I promise too much and I fail. Father, take it away. It's an idol. They are blocking your blessings. Mighty God, what I say I will do with God, I will do. What I say I will do to myself, I will do. This service, I promise you, Lord, in the, in, in the church, in San Bernardino, mighty God, I shall do. That which is in your heart, you have not told anybody. Father, today, whatever that is limiting me, near success children, as if I want to break through. You know, that one is, you will see yourself, you just you just cut corner again, you landed in zero. And when you start prayer again, it's like you have not started. Every spirit of delay begin to cast. Let them be destroyed. I have entered into my room and all. I have entered into my promised land. I have entered into my land of victory. I shall never go back. I shall never go back. Back, I shall never go back. I shall never go back in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. My father did not live old. We live, my me and my younger ones, we live as orphans. My mother died at the prime of life. My father, first of all, died at the prime of life. He had a joint, uh, it was in about seven all courts. One, they say I should join. I was still, I think I was in SS1 then. But my mother vowed that if I join Oboni, it will, she will disown me. What am I trying to say? But at the end, what it, she it did affected him so badly. 
he began to donate his children one after another. I remember vividly the second born from me, my father wanted to use him for sacrifice. See, let me tell you, my brother and sister, my praying life and all, what I do, I, I fear no devil. It is the background, the foundation where I came from. It was not good at all. So if I don't owe God's way, I will die before my time. I think my father died at the age of 52. What am I trying to say? At the prime of life, there are things our father has put on. I remember in those days, they will hijack us on the road and they will be fighting us. What happened? They say, my father has collected their wife. All those things have repercussion on children. Remember, if you have a first son or a first daughter and the last daughter or the first, uh, the last daughter, you have to pray for them well. Because if the spirit did not get the first one, they will go to the second one. If they don't get the second one, then they go to the last one. So that is why we take time to pray for our firstborn and pray for our lastborn. I'm giving us a secret because to this end was I born. My father is an occultist, was an occultist. My mother also entered, there is what we call Aruta in their own language. This spirit will come and indwell you. When it dwells you, you will begin to speak like man. I was there, they did not tell me. This casting of devil, you see people shout and you will see them fall. This is, the, this is practical evidence of what I saw that day. My father slapped my mother unexpectedly. The spirit spoke out of my mother, say, have you brought me, my daughter, here to torment? Instantly, my father, who was a burning member, was afraid of this kind of terrible oracle inside, evil oracle inside my mother. And my father, being that he was trained in the land of my mother, he asked, he asked me to tell Baba that what did Baba need? Baba told me that he needed, he needed, he need, three, uh, what is it called? A uh, cola that has three pieces, that has three, 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 three mark. If you break it, it will be three pieces. Then seven alligator pepper. That is what I gave my mother. Instantly, it should Baba disappear. There are forces that come into people. When you see somebody manage, you will do some things you don't know why you did it. You do some things you don't, there are forces that is making you to do that. So you break those forces and that spirit left not too long. I have this vision of seeing right from bad, right from time. I was 12 years old when I begin to notice. I look at my father, I told my mother that my father would kill himself. That is what let her happen. After, after everything that day, I saw something. One day my mother woke me up in the morning and said, do you know that I did not sleep at home? I, I, Mommy, you are on the bed. And I said, no, the Baba inside her, that is the dead man that has died 50 years, came out in Dwella and took her because a witch came to torment my mother that night. She took the, the spirit of my mother and left the body and my mother slept in the farm. I'm telling you a practical true life story. If you have not seen power before, ask God to give you grace to see power so that you, when you come in contact with this kind of forces, so you can destroy them. All these things you see us do, you see us online, it's practical evidence. So it's practical. And after, when I came to Kaduna, after everything, my father died, my mother died, I, they were buried. I came to Kaduna. I, uh, God told me after I was born, until I become 40, before I can go to my village. If I'm not 40, I may die. But when I was 40, I went there, miracle happened, practical miracle. Babala would them in those days, we do juju together, they begin to get become born again. On phone, they were born in again. They were giving their life. Some people bought Bible before I even came there. They know me as Victor. But when they begin to see what I'm doing, I would, God will call them and begin to, they were surprised. You are going to cry out for power. If there is another thing you need in this program is power. And when you come out and talk, let your eye be shining. Nobody could be behind the eyes of the face of Moses. He said he was covering veil. They when you meet Jehovah, there is something in you that is called transformation that makes 
that makes you relevant. You don't aspire. You are going to pray. You are going to pray. Father, I want this power. I want this power of resurrection. I want this power to affect my world. I want this power to confront the devil. You don't know where you will go tomorrow. Where devil will be afflicting somebody, where witchcraft will be afflicting somebody, and you are privileged to be there, and those things are happening around you, you can't do anything. Father, empower me today. Empower me that I may be the pillar standing for my family. Begin to pray, begin to pray, begin to pray. Empower me, empower me, empower me, empower me, empower me, empower me. Empower me. Empower me. Quicken me, quicken me. Empower me today. Empower me today. Empower me today. Empower me today. The kingdom of God. God is not bread and meat. It's not meat and bread. The mouth is not given to food alone. It's given for the word of God. Mighty God is in demonstration of the spirit and power. Father, I, I, I'm, I'm going to be confronting some kind of spirit and demon that I have not seen before. Mighty God, empower me. Let power, let practical power be evidence in my life. Be evidence in my life. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Let, let me tell us a short story about me and my father. In those days, my father have, have a big shrine, a one, one full house is a, a shrine. Then the, the east room also has a shrine. So it will tell me to take this and take this and take this and do this. It will work. I, I asked him, Daddy, why is it that you are sending me to do all this? He said, because anything I touch, the charm I touch, it works well. People were coming from our nature, from Lagos to, to acquire power from him. And me and my father, some days we will go to the cemetery. We will sleep for three days to acquire power. Least, you know, so I am, I am born in the evil area as a son of a lion. But today, the lion of the lion himself has enveloped me. A man, when, when they now want to initiate me to the masquerade court, the masquerade came. I don't know what, it's on, vid, it's on this olden day video. I don't know where the cassette, one day I will look for it so that we can burn it out too. So I was small at that time. They say I will take the place of my father. It is when I became born again that the Holy Ghost was telling me, this is the taking place of my father. I will not be crying that I wish my father was alive. I wish my father was alive. We will sleep in the cemetery three days. And what does my father eat? My father does not eat. He will only be true, he will be eating, you know, you know this uh, termite, the house of termite. He will break it and be eating the house, that out, termite house, be eating it. That is what he will eat. And you now, as, as a brother, as a Christian, you, are, you, don't, you don't even have a fasting life. And you say you will confront that kind of person in a battle, you can't conquer him. He was one of the best native witch doctor around his terrain. People fear him. So, I, and I was the brain behind it because it was using my hand. And the spirit of God in me was using my hand to perform miracles for others. But it, one thing about my father, he was a graduate, he finished, he, he, he was a tutor in Buddha before the, 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 the demon entered him and he left the work and began to do juju. So his destiny was thwarted. He was a man servant in the man Catholic. So I pray your destiny will never be changed in Jesus' mighty name. Your destiny will never be changed in Jesus' mighty name. That this man, this my father, we, we, we give all that chance to pass his hand. But I will ask him, why are you not giving me? He said, he doesn't want my brain. He doesn't want my brain. He doesn't want my brain to be dull. But those ones, there is a repercussion that they will not be able to use their brain effectively. Some of them have died. Though. Some of them are useless. Some of them, there is nothing that the devil will give to you that he will not take in the other way around. Devil have nothing to give to you. What ended? So there is, there was a, a higher level of witchcraft and occult. But my father, I, wa I was there. I paid money. I, I, he gave me the money to go and give. I remember I was this month. I, I drove his bicycle, one of his best bicycles. 
there to give the money immediately enter those those uh, those witchcraft and occult they dress like pharaoh of egypt they will tie they will tie something like mats they will you will see you will see their their sign with eyes with with one eye and you will see three finger we have entered into the place hoping that they will they will they will, they will, they will, will be initiated but thank God for my mother who rejected and refused that the student cannot join Oko. Actually, we ate their food, but it has nothing to do with us. It has nothing to do with us because God was inside me preparing me for a day like this. And my father now enter, he now know, he now become a two or dauphin of a bony fraternity and all that court. We are like under him, and power is intoxicating. He begin to do and he break their rules. He break their rules. That is when they now cut his life short. And before he die, he know when he's dying. He prepare our heart. The one thing he told us, and he wrote our name. He said he's going on a journey. He wrote our name that we should join any kind of church of our choice. My father, that will not allow us to enter into any church. I remember when I went to what Jesus of Nazareth when I was still standing. I will stay outside for three days. Black and white television. No. I will stay outside for three days. On sometimes I will clamp a tree and sleep. If I come by, he say he did not burn me inside church. But the same father now telling me that we should join any church of our, our, our ours, and he begin to cry. So Jesus is the ultimate. God is the ultimate. There is no Oboni, there is no Ocon, there is no marine kingdom, there is no power. We have tested it. There is no power like the power of Jesus. Who can give life and salvation? I am not talking like this. I have practiced it. We have seen it. We have demonstrated it. We have done it. But today, light has come. I pray this salvation we preach is coming to be a real. You will feel God tangibly. Your prayer life, as I'm talking to you right now, your prayer life on today is changing. Is changing. You that you are times you will pray. You will be praying. You will be praying. You will doze up on your knees. It's even better that as at least you started. And you that don't, you can't pray for just two minutes, five minutes, you sleep out. I pray grace to pray more 10 minutes, 15 minutes, 20 minutes, one hour. Receive, receive, receive. You are going to pray as I begin to round up. Oh Lord, my Father, equip my spirit, man. Anywhere my spirit is summoned, in any kingdom, in the dark kingdom, in the marine kingdom, because you have given me room enough. Mighty God, let them be scattered. Let my spirit object. Let let my spirit object. Let my spirit object. Let my spirit object. Let my spirit object. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Oppose them. 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 Ekota lagaba. Ezanta daraba. Why am I saying those stories so that you can be able to stand with God? So that you can be able to know that that word exists. So that you can be able to know that there is life after death. So that you can be able to know that there is power that is bigger than power. So you can begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, 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 open doors, blessings, 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 blessings. I see, I see number, I see, I see C, 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 C. That is number three. The force of the Holy Ghost. The name that starts with C, the force of the Holy Ghost. The name that starts with C, the force of the Holy Ghost. 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 In the name of Jesus. Trinity. Trinity. Mighty God. The force of the Holy Ghost. Come upon that name. Come upon that name. Anywhere that name will be called. The council. Catch fire. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, anywhere your 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 pictures, your your images, even somebody looking at you on the line, looking at you, maybe you are passing that capture your image in their inner heart and take you to anywhere to describe you to a native doctor, a witch doctor. Let that coven be destroyed. Let that coven be destroyed. Let that coven be destroyed. Not everybody you can carry to a shrine. Not everybody you can carry to a court kingdom. Not everybody you can carry to a witchcraft coven. Mighty God. 
God, let there be fire in their kingdom. In the name of Jesus, 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 in Jesus' mighty name. I always say our helpers also need a father. Let us begin to pray for our helpers. Our helpers, people who have been a, 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 a blessing to us, one way or the other, Father, bless them. Bless them, oh Lord. Touch them. Bless them. Meet them at the point of their need. Begin to pray for them. Your helper, no matter, even when I was, I, I, I was, I was teaching the other day, I said even the president of a country needs helper. If you don't, if you don't need help, I will not win the election. Father, our helpers, Father, bless them, bless them. Whatever that is their problem, Father, solve it, O Lord, solve it, O Lord. Make them peaceful. Give them room enough. Begin to pray for your helpers. Begin to pray for your helpers. I pray for my own every day. Pray for your helper. If somebody promised you, somebody has promised that person also. Somebody that has promised that person, that promised that person. Somebody that promised that person, that promised that person. Maybe that person, that first person failed. The other one will fail. But that one we fail. So you don't blame people. Father, you are help us, oh Lord. Bless them, oh Lord. Take them to lamb life. Give them what they need. In the name of Jesus. God says, I should tell you that you will not bury any of your children this year, even in the year after. You will not bury any of your children this year, even there in the year after. In the name of Jesus. That boy that is like, he it doesn't, it, it can't come. Yeah, that, that, I see a boy, a, a young boy that he don't, he can't comprehend well. He, he doesn't understand well. Let his brain be open now. Be open now. Be open now. Be open now. Hey, also a young girl, be open now. The children, their memories are open. They are smart. They are smart. They are smart. In the name of Jesus. I see somebody also like, like as if changing a job, changing a job. Now, as, as you leave, you get a, get a greater one, a greater one. I see like changing a job, changing a job to a greater one. I see changing a level. Oh, from a, a, a from a, a higher a higher level to a higher level, I by grace I, I pray for you as you leave another one uh, another greater one comes in the name of Jesus in Jesus mighty name we pray. Praise God. Now, if someone say leave my life, you did not leave the world now. Leave my house. There is outside to stay. Hallelujah. Leave yeah. my life does not mean leave the world. Leave my house does not mean leave outside. You still have a place to see that somebody is being sacked or somebody is being jilted or something happened and you feel so confused. You feel, no, if disappointment did not come, appointment will never come. Until we experience this, we will not see the power of God. At times we experience this thing so that our faith will be, we will not be confidence in man, we will be confidence in God. One day, one air vice marshal, that time I went to pray for him. He told me that he would take me to uh, David Mark. That time, bless memory. The man, the, the, he, want, he, would have, he want to take me on Friday on his way coming from his village on, on Wednesday to prepare me to so that we can go to meet David Mark. That time, Senate President of Nigeria, the man died on the road, died in the car. So human being, I see human being, that we pray for our helper to continue to live long. Uh, all our helpers, Father, bless them, open doors for them. Nothing like sickness, nothing like evil, nothing like setback. Whatever they lay their hand to do, they will be blessed. The office you are working, you bless the place. So the reason why they will succeed is because you are a child of God who is always involved in prayer. There is a particular man, that is a particular woman that is praying. I remember Remember when I when I became born again, my elder sister, who is a pastor, also a, a woman of God, asked me which ministry are, are you functioning? Are, are, are you called to? I say I am word impact because I like preaching the word. I love preaching the word with the until that day came. He said, My brother, who will deliver us? You are the only, the only strong son that I know that will come out. So who would be better today? I am the one conducting deliverance for the whole family. I pray God will use you as a pillar in your generation in the name of Jesus. God will use you as a pillar in your generation in the name of Jesus. We are going to pray one more time. Say, oh Lord, use me as a vessel. I avail myself. I avail myself. Use me, oh Lord. I am available. I am available. Use me. If God did not use you as you are breakable, as you are breakable, 
you be modable. Uh, if God did not use you, you won't see the best of yourself. God use me. Use me. Use me to wipe away tears from people's eyes. Use me to wipe away tears from people's face. Are you happy when you see people die? Are you happy when you see people in, in, in accident scene? Well, what do you see when you see people in pain? When you prick your heart, when you, you will make you sad, when he prints you and you cry, it's a pointer to the problem you are created to solve. So, Father, help me. Help me. Help me. Remote me. Remote me. Re-energize re 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 me, oh Lord. Let me come out with a burning passion. I have the room enough now. Mighty God, bless me. Open doors for me. That I may be a blessing to my generation. Thank you. Begin to appreciate God. Begin to appreciate him. Give him thanks. Give him thanks. Give him thanks. Father, we thank you, Jesus. We thank you because you have made the room enough. Magatolo katalade. Ezon kabalada. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. We worship you. We worship you. We worship you. We bless your holy name. We give you praise. Just appreciate him. Just appreciate him. Just appreciate him just appreciate him just appreciate him give him times give him time you will never go on a journey of no return the same you that lock your door you will be the one to unlock it your children shall run about your table at your own age 90 years you shall live and above 100 years if christ died, you still be alive some of you i'm talking to you 50 years to come you will still be alive in the name of jesus no matter the number of your years it shall be well with you, your offspring, your siblings, your family, your brothers, your office, everything around you. They have room enough. They are robots in the name of Jesus because the everlasting living God is available. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus, for the privilege of life. Thank you for the prayer. Thank you for all that you have done today. We bless your holy name. We give you praise for teaching us. We give you praise for answering all. Take glory, Lord. Take honor, Lord. We bless your name. Take glory, Lord. Our woman of God, our mother in the Lord, our father in the Lord, mighty God, who are the hosts of this program. Bless them. Bless them. Strengthen their inner man in the name of Jesus. And they may be able to carry us through in the name of Jesus. Father, ability to follow, give it to us. In the name of Jesus, mighty God, ability to guide, give it to us ability to lead give it to all thank you everlasting father thank you mother holy ghost in the name of jesus you that is into buying yourself receive receive just be blow blue something just be blue some room and now as you buying you sell you buy you sell receive 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 the blessing receive it but just be just be just be making impact just be making impact open doors thank you father for in jesus mighty name we are praying. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. I hand over. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. Hallelujah. 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 God bless you. Hallelujah. 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 H